Our Military Medical Industry Day, Innovation Day, is really an opportunity for us to bring together practitioners, uh, entrepreneurs, businesses, and leaders within the sector to really offer an opportunity to network and potentially create some great collaborations that can be rooted here in San Antonio. Early last year, we received the San Antonio Medical Innovation uh, arm of the city department under Velocity, and one of the commitments was to bring over 300 people to learn about medical and military innovations in San Antonio. Bringing the best of the best in the military research community and also interested parties in the public sector and universities and also the private sector and companies. And the purpose of the day is for them all to get together, hear stories, hear lectures of what I'm doing, what you're doing, and to raise their hand and say, hey, I think I have something that I'd like to work with you. Uh, and so it's all about collaboration and innovation. There's a lot of really interesting work that's taking place here that affects uh, soldiers and, and different military members who um, are injured in combat. Being able to um, predict and or figure out what tools, products, whether it's a device, a vaccine, whatever, being able to predict um, the next area of conflict, that they might come in contact with something that we don't have a solution for, that's what you learn about at these, at these conferences. I think the, the most important thing you guys are going to do today is be here because what you're doing is you're showing and demonstrating your, uh, the efforts that you're placing towards supporting our needs. I think for a lot of people, especially in industry and academia, they view the Department of Defense as this Byzantine, you know, this thing they don't quite understand. And so, so these type of forums give people access and can talk to us and we can guide them through kind of like our processes and how we go, what the type of business that we do. There is just a great mix of military and industry coming together, a lot of curiosity and a lot of, uh, a lot of roots being planted that I think are going to uh, result in a lot of cool things coming out. Uh, well, we continue to, to want to grow this, really uh, the addition of the business vendor space where people can actually see the technology working. Uh, I love the, one of my favorite things is the um, kind of the pitches with the, the timed events where you connect the businesses with the different military entities. Uh, and so really being able to continue to expand that. And Elasti Texas has added the um, events leading up to this and so how do we just continue to kind of build this to a year-round initiative with MMID being that kind of culmination celebration. I've been involved in coming to this event since year one and I can see it's uh, uh, growing in terms of like the number of people participating, the technologies uh, that people exhibiting and presenting. I also can see that they're, they were getting more attraction from headquarters of the military and the DOD uh, coming down to San Antonio to uh, present or to just attend the, the event. Well, San Antonio has an incredibly strong and growing biosciences and healthcare industry and we want to make sure, number one, that the world knows about it, but also that they see San Antonio as a convening space to create that kind of innovation that could take businesses to the next level or really start something entirely new. Just the past five years, I've just seen this ecosystem mature much more. And I, I can see a future state being, I mean, do we just continue on that path, but San Antonio's prominence and you know what it's known for and the engagement that it receives just continues to grow. And soon, if you want to do anything with the military, particularly in the medicine space, how are you not in San Antonio? <laughs>